people! Welcome back to our video. Today we're going to talking about vitamin B6. Let's check it out! Vitamin B6 is a water-soluble vitamin that is naturally present in many foods, added to others, and available as a dietary supplement. Pyridoxal 5-phosphate and pyridoxamine 5-phosphate are the active coenzyme forms of vitamin B6. Substantial proportions of the naturally occurring pyridoxine in fruits, vegetables, and grains exist in glycosylated forms that exhibit reduced bioavailability. Vitamin B6 in coenzyme forms performs a wide variety of functions in the body, mostly concerned with protein metabolism. Both pyridoxal 5-phosphate and pyridoxamine 5-phosphate are involved in amino acid metabolism, and pyridoxal 5-phosphate is also involved in the metabolism of carbohydrates and lipids. Vitamin B6 also plays a role in cognitive development through the biosynthesis of neurotransmitters and in maintaining normal levels of homocysteine, an amino acid in the blood. Vitamin B6 is involved in gluconeogenesis and glycogenolysis, immune function and hemoglobin formation. The human body absorbs vitamin B6 in the jejunum. Phosphorylated forms of the vitamin are dephosphorylated and the pool of free vitamin B6 is absorbed by passive diffusion. Vitamin B6 is found naturally in many foods and is added to other foods. You can get recommended amounts of vitamin B6 by eating a variety of foods, including poultry, fish, and organ meats, potatoes and other starchy vegetables, and vitamin B6 also available in dietary supplements, usually in the form of pyridoxine. The amount of vitamin B6 you need depends on your age. Average daily recommended amounts are listed here in milligrams. For birth to six months are 0.1 milligrams, infants 7 to 12 months 0.3 milligrams, children 1 to 3 years 0.5 milligrams, children 4 to 8 years 0.6 milligrams, children 9 to 13 years 1.0 milligrams, and teens to adults have different daily recommended amounts of vitamin B6. Pregnant and breastfeeding condition also affect recommended amounts of vitamin B6. What happens if I don't get enough vitamin B6? People who don't get enough vitamin B6 can have a range of symptoms, including anemia, itchy rashes, scaly skin on the lips, cracks at the corners of the mouth, and a swollen tongue. Other symptoms of very low vitamin B6 levels include depression, confusion, and a weak immune system. Infants who do not get enough vitamin B6 can become irritable or develop extremely sensitive hearing or seizures. If you think consuming vitamin B6 beyond the limit has no impact on the body, you are wrong. Taking high levels of vitamin B6 from supplements for longer can cause severe nerve damage, unsightly skin patches, extreme sensitivity to sunlight, nausea, and heartburn. The symptoms usually stop when they stop taking the supplements. Am I getting enough vitamin B6? Certain groups of people are more likely than others to have trouble getting enough vitamin B6. Among them are people whose kidneys do not work properly people with autoimmune disorders, and people with alcohol dependence. Are you curious? What are some effects of vitamin B6 on health? Some scientists had thought that certain B vitamins might reduce heart disease risk by lowering levels of homocysteine, an amino acid in the blood. Although vitamin B supplements do lower blood homocysteine, research shows that they do not actually reduce the risk or severity of heart disease or stroke. People with low levels of vitamin B6 in the blood might have a higher risk of certain kinds of cancer, such as colorectal cancer. But studies to date have not shown that vitamin B6 supplements can help prevent cancer or lower the chances of dying from this disease. Some research indicates that elderly people who have higher blood levels of vitamin B6 have better memory. However, taking vitamin B6 supplements does not seem to improve cognitive function or mood in healthy people or in people with dementia. Scientists aren't yet certain about the potential benefits of taking vitamin B6 for premenstrual syndrome or PMS, but some studies show that vitamin B6 supplements could reduce PMS symptoms, including moodiness, irritability, forgetfulness, bloating, and anxiety. Based on the results of several studies, the American Congress of Obstetricians and Gynecologists recommends taking vitamin B6 supplements under a doctor's care for nausea and vomiting during pregnancy. So, that's a brief explanation about vitamin B6. Thank you!